just walked up on a buck. It was eaten next to the creek and uh, he was probably a six pointer, not real big, but still pretty cool. About 20 yards from him. He's over there blowing at me. Now he's mad. He ran up the hill. But I'm just out today and uh, I'm going to go put my uh, trail camera back up and then uh, I'm going to try to find that part to my tree stand that I lost. <clears throat> so uh, maybe after that, see if I can catch a fish or something to eat. But stick with me here on the KY Woodsman. Okay, so I've been walking for about 25 minutes to get back where I'm going and uh, getting kind of hungry. So I noticed down here by the creek there's a little pond and there's a big, not big, but a bullfrog down in there that's eating size. So uh, I just happen to have my frog gig in my survival pack. And uh, I'll break this off here. See if I can convince him to be my lunch. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do a little whittling and mount this on here and I'll uh, let you be part of the action. Okay, that ought to do pretty good. There we go. Okay, you can't see him, but he's right down here. Probably see him jump if he gets away. I guess give us an A for effort. He would have been tasty too. Okay, so main thing I came here for was uh, put up my trail camera and uh, maybe do a little bit of fishing. The frog would have been a plus, but uh, we'll just move on. There might be other frogs. Okay, I'll see you in a bit. They make these uh, straps that are just amazing. They're uh, Master Lock Python. And I painted it like a tan color to match this tree a little better. But uh, what I usually do is just thread it through. And it goes through the case. And when it goes through like that, it locks the lid from coming off. Because the strap's going through. Here, let me show you. It's a pretty cool case. Let's see. It's got where it runs through this and through this. So it pretty much locks everything together. Good deal. Keeps people from stealing your stuff. It's a shame you got to worry about that. You work hard for something. You know, they should work hard for it too, not to steal it from you. But God will settle that up when they stand before him. Okay, so I run it through like that, and I'm going to bring it around. And then something I do is on my sensor, I just put a piece of tape over it, and that way my camera's ready to rock. All I got to do is take this off, and then it'll tell it, hey, there's something in front of me. So it doesn't take pictures until I take that off. Black out. There we go. Just tuck her in. And I mean, you can't budget. That's good. So now I'm going to go ahead and see if I can find something, some bark or something to put over the top of it. It's done. 
I'm glad. I'm gonna take this tape off here. <clears throat> and let's start her going. She's all set. Anyway, we'll give it another week and let my scent go down and, and then I'll come back and pick it up and I'll show you what I found. Okay, so on to fishing. Oh, man, you had it. Dang. Oh, come on, get it again. Yeah, got him. All right. Good. <laughs> there we go, folks. What do you think? What do you think? Let's see if we can catch one more bluegill. That's all it needs, one more. Just one. Couple bluegill would hit the spot. I was walking down the trail and a uh, big, huge, he's probably a foot, foot and a half tall, red headed woodpecker was on the side of a tree and he flew over to oh, another yeah, tree. Red headed woodpecker. And uh, anyway, I hope you got that. I tried to get my camera out real quick and get him. But uh, very cool. You never know what you're going to see here. Okay, so I only ended up catching one bluegill, and that's really not enough to uh, do much. So I threw him back, and uh, getting a little bit late today. I need to go ahead and get out of the woods, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and call it a day here. But uh, I got the trail camera up. I'm real happy about that, and, uh, and you know, got to get out here in the woods and see some things and have a good time. So thank you for joining me here on the KY Woodsman. God bless you. Bye-bye.